Well, new this morning, a personal collection preserved for the future. As ABC 15's John Genovese shows us, one Valley man with thousands of Arizona books and memorabilia is helping a popular magazine complete its public archive. Money. Uh, guns. We found a, an old rusted pistol. Dennis Chandler has so many stories. He had this gold ore. But beyond the ones he tells, this is 1951. Are countless more arranged and waiting on these shelves. You know, there's so much history, you know, I mean, the Cowboys and the Indians. Chandler came to Arizona when the state itself was just 34 years old. So I was a, a baby. From plates to metal licenses. See, there's the driver's license number. He's always on the hunt for anything State 48. There's not much I don't collect. So a few weeks back, a neighbor reached out to him about something they'd heard. She told me, she says, you know, I was listening to NPR and Arizona Highways is looking for a December 1930 issue. And I thought, well, I think I've got that. Chandler loaned the magazine that issue to digitize for their library. It's not the first time he's opened up his for everyone to enjoy, because at 72 years old, a prospector out in the desert leading a mule, he wants these stories to keep being told. I think it's kind of important to know where you've been so you can kind of have an idea of where you're at and where you're going. John Genovese, ABC 15, Arizona. Very cool. How fun to just kind of sit with him and go through that stuff. Chandler's talked at Valley Schools about our state's history, and he plans to eventually donate his collection to one of our state's universities. Awesome. Well,